Chapter 9 Housing All animals including human beings need a shelter that can protect them from changing weather conditions and other dangers. We see different types of houses around us. They differ in size, shape, location and construction materials. Some belong to the owner while some are rented by tenants. Different types of houses Kacha house We build houses that are suitable to the place we live in. The houses found in villages are mostly Kacha houses. They are made of straw, mud and sticks. They are temporary houses. These houses are not very strong and at times strong winds can blow them away. Huts made of mud and water are cool from inside in summer. Pakka house Pakka houses are found in cities. It is made up of bricks, iron and cement. They are permanent houses. They can withstand strong storms and heavy rainfall. All bungalows, flats in multi-storied buildings and apartments are pakka houses. Scientific fact A multi-story apartment building has a number of similar houses built over several floors. These are also called flats. A good house a good house, big or small, has some essential features. A good house should get a lot of fresh air and sunlight. A house should have many doors and windows. Doors and windows should have a wire netting to keep flies and mosquitoes away. Open spaces like veranda or a courtyard gives us fresh air, sunlight and a place to play in. A kitchen must be well ventilated to let the warm air out. A house should have a good drainage system to carry away dirt, water and other waste materials from the kitchen and bathroom. Plants should be grown around the house. They help to make their air clean and add beauty to the surroundings. The floors of the kitchen and bathrooms should be sloping so that Water can flow out easily. Some animals are uninvited and stay with us in our house. They spread diseases and make us sick. We should try to get rid of them by using proper ways. They are ants in room, spider, cockroach, housefly, lizard, mosquito. A clean house. A house should be kept clean and tidy. Living in a dirty house can cause many diseases. The floors of the house should be swept and mopped every day. Wash basins, bathrooms and toilets should be washed and cleaned every day. Furniture should be dusted and cleaned regularly. Dustbins should be kept wherever they are needed and should always be covered. All the things should be arranged and kept at proper places. We should remove cobwebs regularly. Curtains should also be used. They not only add to the beauty of our rooms but also keep the dust out. Even they protect us from heat and light in summer. Different places of the house. A good house have these different rooms. Bedroom, drawing room, kitchen, bathroom, Toilet, dining room, study room, balcony, lawn, storeroom.